Hello, I'm Marcus Johnson from Glass A Media and today we're going to be talking about branded content and all the marketing benefits that come along with it. Branded content is when a brand aligns itself with a piece of creative content. For what we're looking at, this will be video content. This technique has been used for years in various different forms. Historical examples of this would be Colgate's Comedy Hour in the 1950s that even starred Dean Martin and in the 1970s Procter & Gamble had their very own soap opera. Both of these are examples of brands aligning themselves with a piece of creative content in an attempt to pursue a different way of selling their products. These have nothing to do directly with their products, but they knew the audience who would be watching that type of program at the time would be interested in their product and brand. So if you think about it in that way, it absolutely makes sense to put the two things together. Colgate knew in the 50s that people who were buying their brand of toothpaste were interested in high-end comedy shows. So what did they do? start their own comedy show, get Dean Martin involved and create some content that people are definitely going to watch and subtly get the Colgate brand in there. So let's look to a more modern day example with Gillette. Gillette sponsor Gillette Soccer Saturday. Yes, this might seem like a direct sponsorship deal, but it's more than that. It's branded content. They are getting on board with a show that they know millions of people watch every week and those viewers align with their brand values. Of course the show isn't about razors or razor blades, it's about football, but of course Gillette know a big part of their target market love football and will be interested in that show. So the viewer isn't experiencing any direct marketing, Gillette are just a partner of the show, therefore it's a softer approach but can have a bit more impact as people aren't being bombarded by the message. Of course Gillette will have their direct forms of advertising and marketing but this is a great balance. It appeals to people in a more subtle way and works hand in hand with their other forms of advertising. These are all fantastic examples and show how branded content is used widely and has been used for years. However, with high quality video content being consumed more and more online now, there's the opportunity for branded content to go even further. As the likes of Gillette, P&G and Colgate have shown over the years, if you can find the right audience, produce the right content for them, you're absolutely onto a winner. So with the era of fantastic video content we live in now, there's no better time to get onto branded content and make the most of these techniques that have been used over the years. So I did say you can go even further with branded content now, but what exactly are the opportunities that are out there? This high-end content is appearing on Amazon Prime, Netflix, YouTube, Facebook are getting in on the act, and Disney are having a go at it now. Okay, I'm not saying produce the next big Netflix blockbuster, but people want to see fantastic video content and there's no reason your brand can't produce it. Firstly, and the most obvious way of doing it, is produce your own content and deliver it for your own channels. The way video platforms work now is that they want high quality content and they want consistent content. So if you can check the box for high quality content, you then just need to create consistent content. This could be one series that's related to your brand, or it could be three or four running alongside each other. The aim here is to attract people to watch your content regardless of what your brand is. Your brand then sits underneath that. If the content's good enough and it peels through the audience that you want it to, people will come and watch it regardless. That is then the golden ticket, producing a series that people actually want to watch. Your brand is then directly linked with that and you can capitalize that in all the marketing ways that you see fit. Nando's are a fantastic example of how this is done to great effect. They have multiple series that they've created on their YouTube channel. These include mini documentaries, recipe videos and chat shows. These are all relevant to their brand in a roundabout way but the key here is that they appeal to their target market. People are watching the chat shows not because it's Nando's but because they want to see the people who are on there. Nando's also do this consistently. To get the actual tangible marketing benefits, you need to keep rolling this content out on an ongoing basis. Just apply your basic digital marketing principles to this content and you'll start seeing it take effect. Okay, some brands and businesses won't want to create the content themselves. That's absolutely fair enough, but there are other ways of making the most of branded content. An absolutely fantastic source of high quality content is YouTube. And who creates a vast amount of those fantastic YouTube videos? YouTubers. YouTube is essentially individuals or a group of individuals who are highly skilled content producers. The top YouTubers also have massive followings that have very specific interests. With a YouTuber, you've basically got a content producer there as well as access to a very specific target market. So, 
By partnering with a YouTuber or a YouTube channel to create your content, you're basically getting your high quality content produced by these people, but also access to a very specific market which will match with your brand values. A real high-end example of this, but great example nonetheless, is Google's partnership with the YouTube channel Yes Theory. They have millions of subscribers and have basically created a community where people have the shared interest of pushing themselves outside their comfort zones. So what did Google do? They partnered with them on a series of videos where they used their new Google Pixel smartphone to create travel videos where they're pushing themselves outside their comfort zone. The video isn't directly about the Google Pixel, it's about pushing yourself outside your comfort zone. So of course, this appeals to Yes Theory's audience. Therefore, it's attracting millions of viewers but they subsequently see the Google Pixel being used as part of this and aligning with their same values. Therefore, Google are gaining access to a market that they know they want to target. This is targeted marketing at the best. These viewers are highly engaged and we know what values they have. Google also get a piece of high quality content produced by Yes Theory on top of having access to their audience. This is win-win for Google. It's a fantastic example of how a partnership with a YouTuber or a YouTube channel can work to great effect for branded content. Okay, that's a pretty big example, and we don't all have the marketing budget that Google do. So let's look at something a bit smaller. Another one of the brilliant things about YouTube is there are a lot of YouTubers out there that get a surprisingly wide appeal for a very niche subject. So you might look to YouTube and think it's all about vlogging and reviews and people gaming, but there's so many people out there with surprisingly big audiences about topics that you might not even imagine. So this is great for your business. No matter what you are selling or what service you're providing, there's people out there who want to see it and are using YouTube as a search engine. They not only want to find out information and be entertained, but they want to be part of a community with shared values and shared interests. A wonderful example I've come across here is the world of competitive eating. The YouTube channel Beard Meets Food is run by a British competitive eater. He basically uploads videos of him taking on competitive eating challenges. Okay, if you're not into this, you might think this is really niche and not many people are interested. But his channel has 950,000 subscribers and the views on his videos just keep going up. Because it is such a niche, you know the people who are watching it are interested in that very specific interest group. It's not a really broad topic, yet it has relatively mass appeal. Enough appeal for a marketing campaign to be run alongside it. So partnering with a YouTuber like that, very much in a way like Google did with Yes Theory, is an even better way of getting into a niche and a very targeted audience. An example straight off the top of my head here would be a restaurant or food producer partnering in on a series of competitive eating challenges. It's that simple. The company would then get access to all this high quality content and the audience that he's developed. This is applicable to all sorts of businesses and all sorts of interest groups. There's so much covered on YouTube. Scale it up or scale it down. Even if the channel only has 10,000 subscribers, you still know exactly what those subscribers are interested in. This is a great way of guaranteeing high quality content that your brand gets access to, but also running a marketing campaign that targets a very specific audience. So I taught you through plenty of ways there that your brand and business can capitalize on branded content. Produce it yourself or collaborate with great content creators. The beauty of it is your imagination can run wild. Attract people to your content with its quality and creativity and then build your brand relationship with them as you go. For me, branded content is the creme de la creme of marketing content. You can produce some truly brilliant video content whilst at the same time developing your marketing strategy and gaining some fantastic results. So what are you waiting for? Start banging your heads together and think about some series that you can produce or collaborations that you can establish. And as always, if you want to discuss any of these ideas or need any assistance producing your own branded content, get in touch with the Glass A team. Head over to glassamedia.com, drop us a message, and we'll be sure to help you out with creating some truly beautiful branded content. Until next time, see you later.